Skaterstan is a non-governmental organisation that provides opportunities for children in skateboarding and education. I was amazed when I heard about Skaterstan. I, I, it, it seems so impossible, <laughs> you know, that, that in, in all of the chaos of, of Afghanistan and Kabul that someone could start any kind of skate project. I'd heard a lot about Afghanistan. The Taliban had banned certain sports. Sports were very, very popular in Afghanistan, but they weren't deemed activities that were appropriate for girls. So it was really fascinating for me to see that skate, skateboarding was possible for girls. And the only reason they were doing it was that nobody had thought to ban it yet. I didn't see any girls playing soccer or any other sports, but they were skateboarding. So I thought, this is cool. Maybe we can um, get some more girls skateboarding. When I first heard about it, I, you know, I wanted to help as best I could, but I really didn't know how. The best I could do was offer equipment, which is what I did. From there, we found a, a fountain that was perfect for skateboarding in. That was really the start of um, the start of Skater Stand. It was important that education was prioritised. That's where bigger ideas started to form. We do a couple of different programs. One is Skate and Create, so they do one hour of skateboarding and one hour in the classroom based around creative type activities. Another program that we have is Back to School, so that's where children that don't go to regular school that are working on the street do an accelerated learning program with us and they're able to do three years of school in one year at Skater Stand. They're also able to then get back into get back into the regular school system. Out of one skateboard on the ground and a couple of excited kids, skateboarding is now the largest sport for females in the country. 